People, Gail, how you doing? I'm doing good, Devin. How are you? Doing well. It looks like you have a little beauty, a little cuddle buddy there by your side. Look at those ears uh, perk up. Who is this? This is a little red-headed guy. His name is Bruce, Sweet and he was baby. one of 19 puppies that were dumped at a shelter back in February. So he's growing up here, and we don't want that. So he's about six or seven months old, and he definitely needs a home. He uh, is fully vetted. He's very sweet. He weighs about 35 pounds, so he's not going to get much bigger. He may fill out a little bit, but just a really sweet dog, and it just really goes to show how much we work with these dogs and um, try to socialize them. He's very social. He's very sweet. He likes other dogs. Um, don't know about kitties, but um, just uh, an overall good boy. He's, uh, like I said, not going to get much bigger, and I think he would be great with the family with children, maybe no toddlers, but his coat is so pretty. He's got some brown splotches. Maybe he's got some Catahoula in him or some plot hound, but he, we just found out he loves to play with these toys, and he loves to cuddle. He he's is a cuddle bug. You can see I really love, is. I love the white stripe. That, yeah, he's got that dark... Um, Eyeliner on. Oh, yeah. he, you know. got, he got all fancied up for this meeting today. He knows that his forever family's out there and he wanted to look his best. <laughs> yes, he does. Look He's at so that tail so wagging. Okay, yes, so if so someone says, hey, Bruce is the dog for me, where can they go about uh, making it possible? They can go to the website at petsforpeople.org, click on that adoption application. We just have a few questions we need you to answer. Uh, submit that. We'll take a look at it. If we think that it would be an appropriate home for Bruce, we'll give you a call, make an appointment for a meet and greet. If you have other dogs, bring them. If you have children, bring them. Let's see how everybody gets along. And if it works, you can take Bruce home the very same day and uh, he can live happily ever after. Absolutely. That's all we want, really, is for our little furry four-legged friends to have a happily ever after. And honestly, yeah. you get a whole lot of benefits from having them around in your life as well. Yes, you do. And Devin, I also want to mention for people, it is deadly hot out. So if you have outside dogs or cats, please make sure they've got some protection from the sun and that they've got fresh, cool water that's not going to be out in the sun. But if at all possible, bring them in. And it's also a good reminder to spay and neuter your pets. Absolutely. I think Bruce is um, very appreciative that you gave those tips and tricks. He's giving you kisses, saying, yes. I approve of this message. So now that yes. we have uh, Bruce's <laughs> approval of all of the message, now we need someone out there to take him in. Uh, if he is your son, your little fur baby, um, definitely go to Pets for People. Again, I'm going to put it on the screen here. It's right there, petsforfurpeople.org. -for Gail, thank you so much for introducing us to uh, Bruce, and I hope you have a fantastic weekend. Thank you. You too, Devin. Take care.